This is the episode you've all been waiting for. This is the episode where you hear me attempt to speak Creolese. Listen at your own caution. Cue title sequence. So I have been living and working in Guyana for close to four years now. Um, a lot of people may wonder, well, why are you here? Well, why? It's because I'm actually a dual citizen. Yep, even though I was born in the States, my family is from the States as well as Guyana. So yes, I'm one of those dreaded dual citizens that you hear about and know. I am, while I'm allowed to visit parliament, I'm not allowed to serve in it. <laughs> Somebody will appreciate that. Anyway, growing up in a mixed home means that I heard a load of sayings, weird sayings sometimes. I heard a lot of old Southern sayings and of course a lot of old Guyanese sayings. And so I said, I am going to share with you all today five of my favorite Guyanese sayings. Now, do keep in mind, of course, the, even though English is the official language of Guyana, the real language of Guyana is Creolese. Creolese is actually a language to itself that was formed primarily based off of English as well as African and even Dutch roots, because of course this was the main way in which enslaved Africans and even Afri African descendants of them were able to speak with each other. And of course, as more of the population grew to include other races that they started to also incorporate their own forms of Creolese as well. With that out of the way, I am going to go into my five favorite Creolese sayings. But before you get to hear me say that, be sure to hit that subscribe button and hit that yellow notification button as well. And of course, don't forget to like and share. Saying one, and this is actually my favorite Creole saying, Muna run till day catch em. What does that mean? Well, let's break down the phrase itself. Just like the moon runs across the night sky until the sun then comes up, they say that's how people operate. Um, for most Americans, you probably know it as the saying, everything that is done in dark comes to light. So just like how the night must eventually end to bring forth the sun, just as the moon runs till the day catch them. Saying two, monkey know which limb for jump. Now, for all you at home, you may be wondering what, what does it mean? What does that mean? All right, what that means is that you know who you can try what on. So what I mean to say is that basically you got certain things that you know that you can say around your friends and you know all that, that you'll be all good. But then you got that one friend that you know that you can't play around with like that because it's going to have some bad consequences. Monkey know which limb for jump. <laughs> number three. This is also one of my favorite ones. Saying number three. Thief man no like see he mati hold the bag. So let's break this one down a little bit for our American and well our non-Guyanese viewers as a whole. A thief man is a thief. A thief man, a robber, burglar, bandit, any of the like. No, like si mati hold the bag. His mati is his mate or his friend or his buddy. So the thief does not like to see his friend holding the bag. So of course, you know, if you're out here doing wrong and thieves wouldn't trust another thief because they know exactly what they're doing. So thief man no like to see himati hold the bag. Saying four. Come see me and come live with me is two different things. Well, that one should be kind of obvious. It's that, you know, that you ever have like a friendship and you think it's all good until you have a sleepover or until they stay a few days with you and it starts to get awful. Well, it's just like what Ben Franklin had once said that house guests are like fish. After three days, they both start to stink. So come see me come live with me. Two different things. Saying five, 
Dusa Nalaiksa. Well, I guess that's kind of the response to the golden rule. It's basically saying that if you you have people who do so or they do so, they do things in such a way, and that person they don't like to have that way done right back to them. So do so na like so. So those were my five favorite Creole sayings. Please forgive me for murdering it, but hey, if you got any better ones, leave them in the comments below. Also, be sure to like and share and let everybody know about what's going on here. So, but, and that before we leave, I have to let everybody know that right now, the Guyanese Ministry of Agriculture has declared October Agriculture Month. So, to show my Guyanese roots and also in celebration of Agriculture Month, next week, I'm going to go and give you all a bit of a tour of where my family came from. Good old Pomeroon Region 2. Anyway, till then, everything you do, do it for the culture.